A new nameplate is coming to the Mazda lineup next year, in the form of the 2023 Mazda CX-50 SUV, which will take on compact crossover rivals such as the Hyundai Tucson, the Nissan Rogue, and the Toyota RAV4. The Mazda CX-50 will be available with either a naturally aspirated 187 horsepower, 2.5-liter four-cylinder, or a turbocharged version of that engine making 250 horsepower. All models will come with a six-speed automatic and all-wheel drive. A hybrid model is also in the works and it will use a powertrain from Toyota. The CX-50 shares a platform with the subcompact CX-30 crossover and the Mazda 3 compact car. Although it's barely larger than the existing CX-5 SUV, the CX-50 wears more rugged styling elements, which is a departure from Mazda's more refined designs elsewhere in the lineup. The CX-50 is offered with a variety of driving modes to suit different conditions, and the car's design makes no secret of its off-road pretensions. A set of narrow headlights, a wide front grille, and smooth body surfacing are all examples of the brand's Kodo design language, but the CX-50 adopts a more rugged look to other Mazda SUVs. At the front, there's a pair of deep vent cutouts that integrate with plastic body cladding on the lower bumper and a silver sump guard. The car also feature S-matte black bonnet graphics, which will likely be optional. The plastic body protection extends to the CX-50's boxy wheel arches with silver trim accents along the sills. The car can also be specified with a set of off-road tires, further emphasizing its all-terrain focus. The front vent cutout S are mirrored at the rear, where the black body cladding extends across the entire lower bumper. A pair of slim, darkened tail lights with a U-shaped LED running light design are similar to those on the Mazda 3 hatchback. Inside, the CX-50 adopts a simplified dashboard design with a widescreen infotainment display in the center. This will be operated using a rotary dial on the center console and not as a touchscreen. A panoramic sunroof will also be offered on the CX-50, a first for Mazda. The familiar 2.5-liter inline-4 will be under the hood, both in naturally aspirated and turbocharged forms that will likely produce around the same 187 horsepower and 250 horsepower as they do in the CX-5. All-wheel drive will be standard equipment, and a six-speed automatic transmission pairs with both engines. A hybrid model will join the lineup later, but Mazda isn't yet sharing details on that powertrain, other than saying it will feature a Toyota hybrid setup. The CX-50 will offer a new drive mode selector that includes off-road and towing modes, in addition to the sport mode that is offered on most current Mazdas. These settings adjust features such as throttle response, steering feedback, and the tuning of Mazda's G vectoring control system. Thanks for watching and give your comments below.